On Tuesday, February 20th, the Pike County Fiscal Court held a meeting to discuss the use of off-road vehicles on county roads. The Hillbilly Trail system has been working to make this possible so long as state criteria are met. Off-road vehicles could also become street legal on certain public highways. What we're going after now is to, uh, we're passing a county ordinance to make it legal to pursue uh, and name county maintained trails, off-highway off vehicle trails to allow them to travel legally if they abide by the statute, state guidelines, which is in KRS 189.281. Also, we can petition the Department of Transportation to allow off-highway vehicle on sections of state-maintained roadways. Uh, we make that petition to the Department of Transportation, they do their studies, and then they either allow or disallow air requests for that section of highway. Appalachian Community Care offers outpatient medication-assisted treatment for addiction, counseling, and behavioral play therapy for children, accepting Medicare and all major insurance. Recovery is hard. Regret is harder. Appalachian Community Care, Pikeville, Whitesburg, 606-432-5660. Find them on Facebook. The Hillbilly Trail System has received much positive feedback and support for this change. For more information on off-road vehicles and the trail system, visit hillbillytrails.com. I can honestly say that all the feedback that we have gotten is 100% positive. Some people say, well, in your position, that's what, what you're going to say. But in all honesty, we have a Facebook page, Hillbilly Trail System, Pike County, Kentucky, that is just vastly used. That's where most of the riders from other states get most of their information, more so than our website, which is hillbillytrails.com. And by the way, there is a lot of good information on our website. The rules are on there to frequently ask questions. All the uh, information to buy a permit to ride hillbilly trails is on that uh, website. But on their Facebook page, it seems like most everyone that comes and rides, that's where they go to, to social media, tell about their experience. And it's been 100% positive feedback of their experience riding hillbilly trails. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.